On June 3, 2024, the areas around the Pearl River estuary, including Dongguan, Shongshan, and Foshan, experienced sudden and severe torrential rains, with some regions facing extraordinary downpours. In Dongguan, the maximum rainfall reached an astonishing 270 mm within three hours, causing significant street flooding in multiple areas. This extreme weather led to severe waterlogging in many parts of the city, including the Venice Plaza section in Guanching, a known flood-prone area, which once again experienced severe inundation with water depths reaching up to one meter. The intense rainfall overwhelmed the drainage systems, resulting in rapid accumulation of water on the streets. Numerous cars were submerged in the floodwaters. One video showed a resident wading through waist-deep water to check on his vehicle, despite onlookers from a nearby overpass urgently calling for him to seek higher ground to avoid the rising water levels. Another video captured a dramatic scene where a car, still running, lost control in the floodwaters. In another part of Dongguan, the torrential rain caused river levels to surge, trapping a boat under a bridge and further complicating rescue efforts. In response to the severe weather, the Dongguan Meteorological Bureau promptly expanded the orange rainstorm warning to include Shakyan. Gaobu, and Chashan towns and extended the yellow rainstorm warning to cover the entire city. Recognizing the gravity of the situation, the Dongguan Flood Control Headquarters elevated the rainstorm emergency response to level 4. To ensure student safety, the Nanqing Subdistrict Office in Dongguan issued an urgent notice. Based on meteorological forecasts, a red rainstorm warning was in effect for Nanqing Subdistrict. Consequently, it was decided that primary and secondary school students would suspend classes on the morning of June 3rd. This decision aimed to protect students from the dangers posed by the severe weather and to prevent any potential accidents during their commute to school. By noon on Monday, the Dongguan East Sub-Bureau of the Guangdong Provincial Emergency Management Department reported that local government officials had quickly arrived at the affected areas to assess the situation and coordinate responses. The combination of intense short-term rainfall and poor drainage systems had resulted in severe waterlogging on several roads, causing significant disruptions to daily life.
好了，肉眼可见，看到这个水位越来越高了，他妈的走不了啦！一大早在东莞大道走不了啦。Meanwhile, Dongguan's relevant departments swiftly initiated rescue and cleanup operations. 卖饭都要解哦，你拖嘅牙烟啦，你拖你拖你拖卖饭都要解哦，你拖咁圆门口啊。The fire department also deployed multiple pumps to extract water from the most affected areas, working tirelessly to mitigate the impact on residents' daily lives. 早上啊，东莞，洪福路又浸埋啦！哇 ！For severely affected areas, the government will provide necessary assistance and encourage community solidarity to face the sudden disaster together. 早上好啊，老板，这不是我不要去上班。是我没办法出门呢，看一看，不要过来，谢谢。Additionally, the government has mobilized various departments to monitor and respond to any new developments, ensuring that all necessary resources are available to support affected communities. 这个水浸的机会就。